After last week's victory away from home against Sporting Calza, the Imps will be looking to continue their winning form into the first home game of the season. Their opposition today, however, a team that took us to extra time in the FA Cup in 2019, newly promoted League Town. After an arguably scrappy performance the last time these two teams met in the FA Cup, the Imps will be looking for a more convincing win this time round. The 2-1 win was hard fought for, with Amy Blinkhorn and Abby Morell scoring on the day. I spoke to Amy about the last time these two teams met and how they can come on top for a second time. So Amy, how did the game against Sporting Kelsey go uh, last week? Yeah, I think we had a um, bit of a nervous start with it being the first game um, of the season. Um, but we did really well to turn the game around and come out with the win, 2-1. Um, it shows a lot of character within, within the team to do that, um, especially from conceding so early on in the game. So how are the team feeling now then? Obviously the game maybe didn't go to plan initially and then obviously you were lucky enough to bring it back. So how are people feeling and sort of what's the overall mood within the team? Um, I think the spirits are really high at the minute. Um, you know, we, we focus on game by game, so getting the three points is, is massive to kick off the season. It, you know, it sets us up to have um, a really good run um, in August. So yeah, the girls are, are really looking forward to Sunday, um, feeling really prepared. So obviously looking forward to the first home game at Morelands against League Town. Last time you played them, obviously it was a very hard fought for 2-1 win. Um, so what are you thinking going into this game then, obviously knowing that it was such a hard game last time out? Yeah, so obviously the FA Cup, um, anything can happen in the FA Cup. So we was going and they was in the league below us at the time. Um, there was a very physical side, you know, we know that that's what they're about. They, they use that very well and it's obviously got them promoted into our league, but um, we're prepared for that. Um, you know, we focus on ourselves and for Sunday we're, we're definitely going to be focusing on our game, what we've been working on in pre-season, what we've been working on in training this week leading up to um, the game on Sunday. Um, yeah, we've got a, a, a lot of depth in the squad um, and I'd say that we, you know, we're, we're we're buzzing to be at home um, on Sunday as well. So obviously you said that they've just been promoted um, to the fourth tier. So do you think that that's maybe given you a little bit of an advantage maybe? Do you think that maybe the game's going to be a little bit easier than you think? Or are you, you know, taking every day as it comes and, and sort of just seeing what happens on the day? Yeah, I think we'll, we'll approach, we approach every game the same. Um, you know, you can never predict how a game's going to go. You can never predict how a team is because obviously they might have recruited really well over the two seasons that we've not come against them. So and you can't, you know, you can't um, ever get complacent with that. So we'll be approaching it how we approach every game and, and you know, focusing more on us than them. Do you think, though, because they are such a physical team, do you think that will definitely sort of play into your hands? Sort of, you know, you can dic you can, might be able to dictate the game a little bit more. Yeah, I think we're, we're definitely prepared for the physical side of the game, um, knowing that that's how they like to win their games is by you know dragging teams into that physicality and um, you know that sort of nasty side of the game. Um, but for me, I, I love them types of games. You know, I'm I'm buzzing for it to get stuck in, um, especially on grass. Um, so, yeah, so yeah. as well, because it's the first home game of the season, do you think that's going to, you know, sort of keep spirits even higher and maybe make you want the win even more? Oh, 100%. I mean, we always want the win, but being at home in our first home game, we're, we're going to be up for it more than ever, definitely. And if you were trying to sell this game against League Town to people that were interested in, in coming to see it at Morelands, what would you say to them and how would you get them down on Sunday? Well, I think it's going to be naturally a very entertaining game with... Um, with their physicality and, and ours and with it being our first home game, um, you know, like I said, we're going to be so up for it to put, to put on a really good show for the fans who do come down because um, we obviously really appreciate whoever comes to watch us um, will always give 110% for, for those watching. So. OK, Amy, thank you for your time and good luck on Sunday. Thank you very much. It's clear to see that Lincoln City will have to work very hard if they want to take any points from League Town today. After being promoted to the fourth tier last season, the game might not be as easy as you first might think. Let's have a look at today's opposition in a little bit more detail. League Town ladies were founded in 2012 and since their formation they've progressed up the Women's National League every year since. Looking forward to this season, currently as it stands with one game gone, League Town currently sit at the bottom of the league after experiencing an 8-0 loss to Solihull Moors on the opening day of the season. Last time Lincoln City women played League Town was in the FA Cup in 2019. 
The game was arguably very scrappy and a very physical affair for the Lincoln women. Amy Blinkhorn scored Lincoln women's first goal of that game. The game against Leek Town at Moorlands is going to be a test for Lincoln City women. Their physicality and resolve will be tested and it's a game you definitely don't want to miss. Now we've looked at the past, it's time to look forward to what's happening right here at Moorlands this afternoon. The small matter of Lincoln City trying to continue their winning form into their first home game of the season. Now to do that, I spoke to Imp's boss, Lee Mitchell. So Lee, obviously after the very tight game uh, last week against Sporting Council, what have you learned going into the first home game of the season? Uh... I think we're a lot of it, we learned that um, control our nerves a little bit and I think that was just the first game to get that under a belt and to focus really on ourselves, um, not to worry so much about the opposition, just focus on what we do best and, and focus on our game and that's what we'll do going into this weekend really. So obviously League Town have just been promoted to the yeah. first tier. Yeah. Um, do you think that because you're favourites to win, do you think that's added pressure for the team? Uh, we don't we don't really look at it that way. Any team in our league is capable of turning another team over. So we approach and we prepare the same way every single time for that consistency. So we'll do the same. We'll have the same focus and uh, same methodologies we use for every team, um, and we'll we'll face them the same way that we do. So um, we don't ex we don't expect anything but high performance from our girls, regardless of where we play anywhere in the league, new or or perennial. So. And obviously, last time you played them in the FA Cup, it was a very physical battle, yeah, uh, yeah. 2-1 against League Town. Do you think that physicality is going to play into Lincoln's hands? Or do you think it will be something that you, will, might be a bit of a challenge? It's something we're aware of. It's something we've practised in pre-season with the tough games we've had. Step three, All Step 3 teams are physical. Um, and I think we've got past that a little bit now. We need it to be a little bit nastier and we need to step up in the physicality. And we've done that. We've controlled games and we've matched anyone that's tried to bully us in their game. So, um, yeah, it's something we're not really uh, worried about at all now. Whereas in the past, it's something we might have been. And the last question then, Lee. Obviously, this is the game, the first game at Moorlands this season. Are you looking forward to it? Do you think being on home soil will, will benefit the girls? Yeah, the girls are excited to play now. Um, away games are tough with all the travel and everything, and the first way was a heck of a travel. So it's nice to be at home. We'll have a crowd behind us, and we're looking forward to it. So we can't wait for Sunday. Thanks. Good luck Sunday, Lee. Thank you very much. Today's game against Leek Town is the first home game of the season at Moorlands. If you're interested in attending, entrance is £4 or just a pound for those that are under 18. If you can't get down to Moorlands this afternoon, however, we've got you covered. If you head over to Lincoln City Women's Joymo account, you can watch the game live from the comfort of your own home.